Good evening. Here are some of the headlines we're tracking today, 25th of October 2021. This is tomorrow's news today. Nigeria launches eNara digital currency as CBN says transactions on the platform free for 90 days. Reps express concern over underfunding of Ministry of Information. Nigeria may have to depend on the UK to get its own information, says Lai Mohamed. Celebrate our troops with pride, Buhari urges Nigerians. Oyo jailbreak. Federal government enlists Interpol to recapture fleeing inmates. IPOB seat at home. A number adopts Saturday as school day. NDLEA drags man to court over alleged peddling of 250 grams of marijuana. In business, Nestle to pay 19.8 billion naira interim dividend amid Q3 profit of 33.6 billion naira. CBN's e naira to grow Nigeria's GDP by $29 billion in 10 years, says Buhari. In tech, Zoom now has auto-generated captions available for free accounts. PayPal says it is not pursuing Pinterest acquisition. On the foreign scene, gunfire and protest as Sudan's military seizes power in coup. Taliban promises to protect EU-Afghan mission. Finally, in sport, renovation of Liberty Stadium starts this week. According to the minister, De Jong suffers classical thigh injury. Thank you so much for listening. Make sure you get details of this and many more now and tomorrow on our website, guardian.ng. And do ensure to pick up a copy of the Guardian newspaper from newsstands tomorrow. Not to forget, you can also connect with us on Facebook, Instagram, Twitter, as well as YouTube at Guardian Nigeria. Have a good night and continue to stay safe.